Hi everyone, Aaron here for Zolotech, and many of you have been asking how to do some basic things on the iPhone 10 that were pretty straightforward on previous iPhones, but since we don't have the home button, things have changed. So the first one is how do you close apps? And the way you do this is first you need to go to the app switcher, and you do that by dragging your finger from the bottom up about a third of the way to half of the way up the screen. So you drag up and then let go. Then tap and hold, and you've got a little minus here. You can close them by tapping on the minus, or you can just swipe them off the screen like you're used to. You can also swipe multiples off the screen at once. So if you want to do that, that's another way to do that. The next thing people were asking is how to show the battery percentage on an iPhone 10. You can sort of show this and you can only see it by swiping down from the right. So you'll see here it says 75%. If I swipe up, it just shows the battery. There's no way to actually show it in the upper right without swiping down. There's no options for it or anything like that. And unfortunately, uh, that's how it is 90% of the time, unless you're swiping down here. The next thing is, how do you take a screenshot? So to take a screenshot, instead of using the home button, you use volume up. So you push the power sleep wake button and volume up at the same time, and you'll take a screenshot. Now you can go into that screenshot, mark it up or do whatever you want. Then you can erase that or hit done, save it to photos, delete the screenshot. And if you want to close it more quickly than that, again, volume up, power, sleep, wake. And if you're happy with it, swipe it off the display and it will show up in your photos. The next thing is how to power off an iPhone 10. This is pretty straightforward and there's a couple different ways to do this. So Apple says push volume up, volume down, and then power sleep wake. So volume up, volume down, hold power sleep wake, and you've got slide to power off. However, if you hold volume up or volume down and the power sleep wake button, it will vibrate and then pop this up and give you emergency SOS medical ID. And then that also locks the phone so that the next time you try and unlock it, it asks for your passcode. Finally, if you need to hard reset your phone or reboot it when it's not responding, maybe touch doesn't work, something like that, you can force it to restart by doing what's similar to what we did to power it off, but we keep holding power sleep wake. So volume up, volume down, press and hold power sleep wake, keep holding it and give it a minute and it will power off and then start back up. So we'll keep holding it. You'll see it powered off. Now it's force rebooted. We can push it again and give it a moment and it powers back up and it restarts. So those are five basics that were pretty straightforward on an iPhone before it, anything with a home button or previous to the iPhone 8 Plus really. And hopefully that gives you an idea of what you need to do. If you have any other questions or comments, let me know in the comments below. If you haven't subscribed already, please subscribe and like. As always, thanks for watching. This is Aaron. I'll see you next time.